Now's the time, Portomaster. Hey everybody, this is Mike and Connor with SkylanderNuts.com. We're here today to do another Skylanders Trap Team character review. I'm going back again to, I think, one of the characters that came out uh, with the game around the same time. Waves 1 and 2 came out really close together, so he was in one of those initial two waves. But um, he was a character we played with for a while, and we liked him, and then he kind of got lost with a bunch of new characters, and then we went back to him again, and I am talking about Chopper. Now, Chopper is a pretty cool character. I think uh, he grew on me a lot more as we leveled him up. And uh, it, we'll see more of that later when we look into his uh, gameplay and all of his attacks. So, Connor. Chopper, he's a dinosaur, right? Yep. He's a little small for a dinosaur. Most of his friends and family are larger. And in his village, every year, they held a hunting competition. Okay? Mm -hmm. Now, when he was able to enter the hunting competition, he, because he was small, he decided to build a gyro dino exosuit. And you can see that here. <laughs> it's basically everything that he is wearing on his character. It is a propeller and a way to fly and things on his legs to make him go faster and a bunch of rockets. Now, he used all this stuff to... Uh, give him an advantage in the hunting competition and one year when he was able to enter he did a very good job and he was winning and he was about to win the competition when guess what a volcano erupted there's always something going wrong with one of these so uh, soon to be skylanders but yeah a volcano erupted and flooded the village with lava so what did chopper do so chopper flied to the village and and saved the villagers. That's right. The villagers were trapped by the lava, and Chopper was able to use his new gyro exosuit to fly above the lava and rescue those villagers one by one until they were all at safety. Then what happened? And then somebody made him a Skylander. Somebody, he became a Skylander. For his acts of hero, uh, heroic acts, he was made a Skylander, probably by Master Eon, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, I want to take a close look at this character now because at first look, when you first look at Chopper, you see his propeller and you're like, well, a dinosaur. Okay. He, fl he probably flies. That's kind of different because he's got a, you know, a blade on his back. But let's take a closer look at him. First of all, he's got a lot of detail. He's got this really nice dinosaur bumped skin. Um, you can tell he's he's got the coloring that goes from kind of brown, light brown to red on top of his head there. Um, you, you definitely got the chopper blade right there. Okay. But notice if you take a closer look at the blade, underneath the blade, what do you see, Connor? Rockets. That's right. He's got the rockets on his blade right there, right here, if you can see that. So you know he's already ready to attack. Plus... He's holding these two um, like jetpack type control arms that will control his flying with his blade. And on his legs, he's got this skeleton, hydraulic-like, um, I don't know, shoes, shoes yeah, encasings in, in on his legs, kind of built into his body almost. Uh, it looks like some pretty serious modifications, and those should let him move faster, uh, because I guess dinosaurs are kind of slow to begin with, and probably allows him to land better when he's flying. So that's pretty cool. Um, a lot of detail there, and grabbing and holding, and those rockets, and then in his mouth, he's got this tongue that's that is uh, flying out. So he's kind of got a carefree attitude. And he's got these teeth. You can see each tooth. And inside his mouth, you can see the ridges of, of his mouth. It's, it's just, I think it's a very well thought out character. Even the top of his head here, you can see how his skin kind of wrinkles up with his backpack that he's wearing. Uh, kind of pushes up on the top of his neck and head. So, pretty cool, I think. What do you think, Connor? Uh, yeah. What, cool. You liked this one early on, did you not? Uh, yeah. 
What what made you like him from the beginning? Well, the chopper blade looks like it could be attached, and the rockets. You like the? Did you notice these rockets on no, his back? No, 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 I didn't. Yeah, but the rocket attack I like. Yeah, I don't think I noticed those rockets either. I mean, when we first bought them and opened them, he was a dinosaur. He had a suit on and he had a blade. It was pretty obvious that he was going to be able to fly, and then from there, it was unsure what his attacks would be. Um, when we started playing with him, yeah, he had rockets, and then when you take a closer look, you can see he definitely has rockets on his character there. So, pretty cool. Um, I, I, you know, when you hear about a dinosaur Skylander, you think, oh, he's going to be able to bite people or or swing his tail and do some massive melee attacks. But, but his tail's small. How could it be? A well, that's right. Attack? Well, his can't. But if you just think about before we even saw Chopper and we heard that they had a dinosaur Skylander coming, that's kind of what you maybe would have thought, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, guess what? He doesn't really have any melee attacks. He's mostly all rockets, all range, all range attacks. So we're going to get him in the game now and we're going to take a look at his moves and we're going to show you everything that Chopper can do, um, or at least the one upgrade path that we chose. And we'll be right back with a closer look at Chopper. Alright, Connor and I are back. We have Chopper on the portal and we're ready to take a look at his moves. Are you ready, buddy? Yep. Alright, we'll go ahead and get back into the Chaos Doom Challenge we were in and start the wave. Alright, well, like I said, I think before, Chopper's main basic attack is called Raptor Rockets. So those rockets uh, we showed you... That's me, buddy. I said X button, buddy. See? Alright. So, X button shoots a rocket and basically blows up some guys. There you go. There you go. Now, we have several upgrades on this rocket already. You see that one going around in circles? That's pretty funny. Um, we have an upgrade to the rockets called Revved Up Rockets. Oh, there it goes again! Yep. I don't know why it's not. See, I just shoot one and it does it. That's strange. They um they have an upgrade called homing missiles. So what you see right there are those rockets trying to home in on a go. bad guy, but for whatever reason, it can't hit those bad guys or it can't turn quick enough. Maybe they're not moving fast enough. I don't know. That's pretty cool. Okay, we're twenty one complete already. All right, that's fine. That was the basic Raptor Rockets attack and some of the upgrades. The Like I said, the revved up rockets just do uh, make the rockets do extra damage. And the homing missiles make them seek out enemies for a hit, which is kind of what we saw happen there. Okay, so um, now? now we're going to show you the chopper blades. Now this is the B button attack, buddy, uh, after chaos is done. So when you hit the B button, you will fly into enemies with your chopper blade this is a pretty cool attack it's a bit of a dash attack but uh, it's kind of what you want a blade on your back to be used for right go ahead hit the B button and show them boom yep you just went right through that thing now just you're gonna have to keep doing it but you shouldn't have that big a problem against most enemies some enemies might block it for some reason but there you go there good go. way to chop right through them now we do have an extra uh -oh. upgrade on that called better blades where the chopper blades do extra damage so kind of typical boom, boom. yeah you just mow right through most of them especially those grenades they don't Very they easy. don't stand a chance the bigger we guys might this. be harder now we also have chosen the Blaster from the Past Upgrade Path. This improves the ra Raptor Rocket and the Chopper Blade attacks. Uh, so okay, there's a... Blocks. Uh, just keep getting them, you're good. The, um, there's an upgrade in there called Props to You where the Chopper Blades do maximum damage. So that means there are really two upgrades to increase the Chopper Blades damage. Uh, not very exciting, but you know, it. as you can see right there, gets the job done once it's uh, all the way 
maximized. Oh, where, where did that, the that thing wave, go? Buddy? Yeah, where did that thing go? The bad thing? Bad things disappear. Oh my gosh. Alright, well, let's see. We need to show them the Y button, the third attack. This you, attack? Yep, that's called Roar. So when Connor presses the Y button, there is a, this is almost like a melee attack. It's got a little bit of range on it. And it's pretty wow. powerful. Wow. It's not as powerful, but it, it'll also knock the enemies backwards, if you notice. So hit them, see, they get thrown backwards, which helps you clear out some space <laughs> if you need it. And it's almost as powerful uh -oh. as the chopper blades, not quite. Yeah, get down to that box, do your rockets. Get down there, you can do whatever. Yeah, there you go. Okay, I'll do that. Eh, it's alright. You're whichever you're you're dominating them. Now I'm sure they'll open the box. When they do, you just unleash whatever on what comes out. Alright? But there is the roar. Uh, we do not have any upgrades for that attack. There is the other upgrade path, which is called Roar Like Never Before. And there you can upgrade the roar attacks. So you can do an upgrade called Call of the Wild, which gives the roar attack more damage and allows it to travel further. Sounds kind of cool. And you have a King of the Jurassic Jungle, where the roar attack does maximum damage with maximum range. So in the same upgrade path, you have two upgrades that just make it go further and become more powerful. Which if but you, if you hold it down, you can do it longer. See? Yeah, it lasts a pretty long time. So it'd be kind of interesting to see what that path would do to make that bigger and longer. Um, but we didn't choose that one. And there's one more attack in that path called ROAR Missiles. And that stands for Raptor uh, Rage of All Raptors. Rage of All Raptor Missiles. So it's basically, it looks like one massive rocket that just comes down from the sky and destroys whatever's nearby. So that does sound like a pretty cool attack, but we did not choose that path. So go ahead, Connor, and start the next wave, and we'll show some of the upgrades that we chose in our path, which, like we already said, the chopper blades do more damage, but we have one called the Bigger the Boom. Um, oh, actually, that's not one to show you either. That's another one that makes the Raptor rockets uh, do more damage by create, creating bigger explosions. But we have one called More Missile. Now if you hold the X button down, Connor, you will get a massive missile. Try to hit that pinata with the massive, hold down the X button. I hold it down, oh, the That's X the, button. Yeah, you're just doing the old B attack again. And now you just, what did you do? I defeated, I, when I hold it down, that, that there you happened. Go. Now people can see it. I think you did it, but nobody could see it because of uh, where you were, but you destroyed both pinatas with that. I have Pfizer over there, here. There, do it, try to stay in back from them and hit them with one of those big rockets. Now you this? notice, yep, there they go. Oh, now, I oh, yeah. killed one. Well, you notice those oh, rockets do God. not home in on the enemy. They go straight, see? You miss the enemy, you, those rockets won't hit. Your regular rockets will come in and hit the guys, but not that attack, so. It did a lot of damage, but it is a little bit harder to hit um, since they only go straight. All right, buddy, that's almost it for Chopper. So we just got, got the Soul Gem? That's right. The Soul Gem is the last one left, and it's a pretty good one. Uh, it's called Ultimate okay. Dino Destruction. Read first. Yep. So do you know how to do this one, buddy? No. Let's no. check. It's not an easy one. Press to, it, jump. It's not an easy one to do, really. you got to press jump twice. There you go. Now you're in flight mode, okay? Okay. Which is by itself pretty cool because uh, I'm not sure if that would protect you from like those laser beam levels where you have to fly out, jump over the laser beams. It might. Um, but now that you're in the air, press a Y button to unleash a rocket salvo. And all these rockets just shoot out in all directions. Oh my god. Yeah, that's pretty cool, huh? Let's start to wave and do it. Yep, go ahead and use that attack for this wave and destroy everybody. everybody Get into flight mode. Like... And as soon as they start coming out, wait for a couple of them to come out though so you get a good number and see how the rockets go after them. Should I do it now? Mm. I see a lot. Okay. <laughs> Coronavirus! There 
you go. And now fly up, fly away from him, do it again. Just fly away. Stay away from the bad guys. They're gonna come after you, but you need to just go away. Oh, my oh God. good, good, good. Now this will be exciting. A troll. Just fly, ah. fly away, and hit the Y button and fly. Rocket, rocket, rocket. Just hit the Y button once and, and just keep running away. Don't run into the wall and get trapped. You're gonna get killed. So, one thing I like about Chopper is his ability to do some pretty massive damage while he's running away. Light mode goes <laughs> away sometimes. Yeah, I think it, there's a time limit to it, but just keep... He's also not super fast in flight mode, I see. He's actually a little faster on the ground, but... His rockets keep going and attacking, everybody. attacking everybody behind you even though you're running away I, I I really like characters that can just run and attack if that happens there you go good job and it's done yep so there you go there's chopper and his attacks I think his soul gem is pretty cool unlike uh, some of the other characters we've reviewed recently where the soul gem doesn't do a whole lot this one adds pretty a pretty good uh, and fun attack, I think. Can I do it one more time? No, we don't want to make this video too long, buddy. Okay. Yeah, so Chopper's pretty fun, as you can tell. Connor wants to keep going with him. Um, he's really pretty powerful. He doesn't have a whole lot of diversity to him, I guess, but just based on the fact that several of his upgrades are used to just make things damage more. Um, so you basically got your rockets, and then they become homing rockets, which is cool. Then Ooh. you have the blade attack, which is like a dash attack. Look, see, you can even do it in a flight mode, and it looks cool. It looks like a big blade. Well, I think it works about the same, but yeah, you definitely can still do it what in flight mode. about the regular mi missiles? Oh. The I regular guess. missiles work Whoa. in flight mode. But why would you use those when you can just hit the Y button once? You don't have to... Oh, look, now those two rockets are doing this. I know. Well, they got nothing to attack. Maybe it maybe it didn't know to attack those other bad guys. Maybe some of them are like ghosts, and it, maybe the rockets don't hone in on ghost enemies. But, uh, and then, of course, you have his roar attack, and uh, we do not have the roar path available to show you, so, you know, if you don't really like the rockets and you want to see more of that roar you could go with that path I'm guessing it would still be pretty awesome and pretty uh, powerful just you would just have to do it uh, different button basically um, but yeah there's chopper I, I really like him I think he got overlooked a little bit early on for some reason um, you know he becomes more powerful definitely by the time you get all the upgrades unlocked uh, until then he's kinda generic I guess just just firing rockets isn't too exciting. A lot of characters have done that, but um, pretty cool. What do you think, Connor? Do you like Flying him a lot? awesome. Watch this. I'll show you that one more time. Hey, what's easier, doing the uh, flight mode or doing the uh, treadhead soul gem move? I think the treadhead one was easier. You think Watch treadhead this. one was easier with the ramp? Do you even yeah. remember what I'm talking oh, about? Oh, no, 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 no. This yeah, that, I don't And one, so. two, three. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it, it's definitely a favorite of Connor's, <laughs> the Soul Gem attack, so he can't stop using it. Uh, all right, buddy. Mm, again, why is it working? So join us on our website at skylandernuts.com. You can see our full written review and a score for Chopper. See how he compares to our other reviews of other Skylanders we've done recently, uh, especially core Skylanders, and I don't even know if we've reviewed any other tech Skylanders, but... Uh, give us a view and uh, we'll see you again next time for another Skylanders Trap Team character review.